working hand. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Welcome for the meditation of April the 4th, 2024. Taken from Proverbs chapter 10, verse 4. He who has a slack hand becomes poor, but the hand of the diligent makes rich. Today, the Lord continues to teach us how we should live. The slack hand, the hand that is slack, is the one that doesn't want to work. Is the person that chooses to rest and sleep doesn't want to work. He can eat and rest and even eat or drink, but they don't want to work. But they become poor. And many times they would take advantage of others trying to steal from them in order for them to just go by living. But if you can control your hands, if you set yourself to work with your hands, and not only with your hands, but with your mind, with your heart, with your whole body, and your work, even if your work is very simple, very lonely, you will be in, in a good shape. Because the work of your hands, the work of the man and the women, produce riches. So if you want to enjoy your life, if you want to be able to share with someone a little bit of what God blesses you with, work. Do not delay. Do not be remiss. But rather wake up in good time. And especially while you are young, work as hard as you can. And do not spend everything that you produce, but save, so that in the long run you are well off in prayers in good deeds and in life. For blessed is our God, always, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen.